Okay, today we're going to look at how to filter noise out of your analog readings with your analog digital converter. Now I have a little resistive touch screen um, just here you can see that goes around the front of this screen. And what happens is it puts a voltage through horizontally and a voltage through vertically and then it, it reads how much resistance there is for it to come through. So then I use the ADC, so I take a, a reading in the X and a reading in the Y, and then just whatever they are, I plot on the screen. So at the moment, the program is just reading the ADCs, and any time it reads the ADCs, it just plots on the screen where those readings are. You see when I move around, you get all sorts of speckling. Speckling tends to average, and it has like some crazy out there, little bits that are long ways off. And that's typically what happens with ADCs. You'll have a number of readings somewhere very close, and then you'll have occasional readings which just seem to be a long way off. So what happens if we average that, or, or if we take, say, half a dozen readings, and we average the half a dozen readings, it won't be very accurate because of these occasional ones that are off, they pull the average away from the center of the cluster. If you rejected all the ones around the outside and just averaged the cluster, you would have a very good reading. But one of the most common easy way to do it is you'll take, say, five or seven or nine readings. You'll sort them into order from lowest to highest, and then you just grab your middle one. So instead of taking the average or the mean, we will take the medium or the middle one. Okay, so what I've done now is I've changed my program and I take five readings. And I sort those five readings in order from lowest to highest, and I just plot the third one as being the middle reading. So if I come on here now, the camera to focus well, you can see now, oh, come on focus well, Mr. Camera, you can see I don't get very little speckling whatsoever. You can see the type of accuracy I get out of my ADCs now. Very, very neat. So that's the easiest way of getting quality data out of an ADC, is to take an odd number of readings, sort them into order, and just accept the very middle one and reject all the rest.